Hey guys, what's up? It's Alicia, welcome back to my channel. So in today's video, I am going to be doing a home decor updates video, things that I've changed in my house since you guys last saw it and just lots of fun home decor stuff. I have been having the best time just like decorating my house it has been such a fun process you guys know how much i genuinely love home decor just everything home so um yeah i wanted to go ahead and give you guys an update on what i have done and what changes i have made since you guys last saw my home updates video as you guys can see i am standing in my master bedroom you guys have already seen this room and honestly not really anything has changed since i've moved in mainly because i am saving this master bedroom as like my project for the end of the year so this room will hopefully be transformed later on this year so um it's honestly still looks the same as you guys last saw it i have like my old dresser and then we also have my um bedding and stuff over here but the update that i wanted to share with you guys here is that i have switched over to brook linen sheets um this video is actually partially sponsored by brook linen i am personally so excited to share this update with you guys because if you are anything like me um sheets are a really really big deal <laughs> um i am like really big on that and so i wanted to switch over to something that was much more comfortable much more luxurious but still affordable and that is where brooklinen comes into play brooklinen was founded on the philosophy that people deserve beautiful simple luxurious sheets and their mission is to provide you with the highest quality and comfortable bedding sheets and towels at an affordable price and the reason why i chose brooklyn and sheets is because for me like i mentioned earlier my bedding and my sheets are everything i want like the highest quality i spend a lot of time in my bed i watch tv in my bed i go to sleep in my bed <laughs> i spend a lot of time in my bed so i want to be comfortable i want like that hotel quality comfort and I just did not get that until I switched over to Brooklinen's bedding and sheets. Not only does Brooklinen sheets feel good, but they look good too. The quality is amazing. Like it legit looks like high quality bedding. And Brooklinen sheets are tried and true, y'all. They have over 35,000 reviews, all five star reviews. So I'm not the only person who loves it. There are plenty of people out there who swear by it and just love Brooklinen sheets just as much as I do. They also have the Brooklinen Lex hardcore sheet bundle so instead of buying individual items you can save 25 percent off and get the hardcore bundle which includes the core sheet set extra pillowcases and a duvet cover i also love the brooklyn and Lux hardcore sheet bundle because you can mix and match over 25 colors and patterns to fit your style so no matter what your style is whether you like darker colors lighter colors patterns no matter what you like they have options there for you and the online experience to order your brooklyn and bedding is super simple just go on there you can mix and match and play around with all of the patterns and colors that they have to offer from the Lux Core sheet set from the comfort of your home and i have some great news for you guys so brooklyn is offering my viewers a special discount of 20 dollars off any order over a hundred dollars so all you guys have to do is click the link down below in the description box so click that link down below and use the promo code alicia williams to get your special discount of $20 off any purchase over $100. That is pretty much it for the updates in my bedroom. Um, again, I'm gonna do a whole video on my bedroom transformation once I actually do it. This room will at some point look a lot different than it looks now. I mean, it looks good, honestly, just as it is. Like, I cannot complain at all, but I definitely wanna jazz it up and make it more, you know, more feminine, more mature, <laughs> more like a master bedroom. So that is coming. But I definitely want to share with you guys um, just how I have changed my life with the Brooklinen Lux Hardcore Sheet Bundle. So yeah, definitely loving that. And now that we're done with this bedroom, I want to take you guys over to my office. All right, y'all. So here on this channel, you guys have not seen like any parts <laughs> of my office besides my little filming space right there. But I wanted to kind of walk you guys through like 
the process and what I have done so far in here. This room is still a work in progress. It's not nearly done. Um, it's just taking me so much longer to figure out what pieces I want to add in here. And this room is kind of like my office space, but also like a glam getting ready room. That's the idea here. It's not just an office space because honestly, I'm not in here a lot. It's more like an office <laughs> space slash get ready, do my makeup, get dressed. That's what this room is mainly for. So here is like an overview of the space. All right. I am like obsessed with the colors <laughs> in um, my little glam slash office room. And then I also have this side of the room as well. But as you guys can see, I have done pretty much nothing <laughs> on this side of the room. So that room will be getting some TLC very, very, very soon. The theme in this room is kind of like boho slash girly slash a little bit of glam. Like it's a mixture of a bunch of different styles, but that's just me. I love to mix different styles together. And so um, this is like my filming um, wall slash like lounging getting some work done wall my little work nook because i will sometimes do work on this sofa and this sofa is actually super comfortable i got this pink sofa from wayfair i will try to link everything that i can um down below so check that out also but this sofa i got from wayfair and i love it i love how soft it is I love the color, it's perfect and it looks great against like the cream colored walls. I also added a plant right next to it. I wanted something tall that gave this area some height and I also wanted to add some green, you know, um, in the area. So I got both the plant as well as the planter from World Market. They have the cutest like planters and um, you know, just like faux plants there so i definitely looked up there i got these two prints from home goods i always get asked where i got those prints from because i will also have it like in the background of some pictures that i post on instagram and you guys always want to know these prints are from home goods and i cannot link them because of course it's from home goods but i would check them out for like um, dual picture sets. This came in a set of two, so it worked perfectly for um, the space. And these ceilings are really, really, really tall. I thought about adding some um, like wallpaper, which I still may at some point, but I also just love the simplicity of how the space looks as is. I don't wanna go crazy. like. I don't want to go crazy. I want to keep it somewhat simple. So I'm loving the vibe of this right now. And that may change at some point, but right now I am loving this just as it is. Um, I also added like this basket with a throw blanket and some throw pillows in there. Just, you know, a cream color pillow, a green pillow and a simple gray blanket. So yeah, that's just to add, you know, some decor in the space. And I also added this gold lamp from Target. I just tap it on and tap it off. Super simple, but I think this is really cute. A cute touch also to the space. And again, because I do read and like sometimes work on the sofa, I definitely wanted to add a lamp in that corner. So that's pretty much it so far for what I have going on on this wall. And then to the side of it, we have my little like desk <laughs> space so this desk i believe i got it from lamps plus i just love it i saw it online and like immediately fell in love with the color it just looks like really cute and modern but still glam and it definitely fits <laughs> the idea that i was going with um and then i also just added like some knickknacks to the desk space because again this is like a desk for work sometimes but also like a makeup space as well i also added this faux flower arrangement that i got from anthropology same for like that decor is also from anthropology um i have like some lip gloss and some lipsticks that i typically go to and like rotate in this little like lipstick storage and then i also added this lamp um just in case i'm doing makeup and stuff at night 
why not add some light over here so um this lamp i got from target like two two years ago i think it's been a minute but i still love it it matches the space perfectly um so you guys can see i have like some brown some white some color going on gray gold pink <laughs> a lot of different colors but yeah it's really coming together and then i found this beauty this mirror from anthropology i love it love it love it it's like the perfect size um it just looks so good in this room and it just ties everything together lastly i wanted to show you guys this light fixture i think it's from anthropology as well i have to double check and i just recently got this hung up so i need to go and like fluff out all of the little tassels um but i love 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 this light fixture it was a little pricey but i wanted a statement piece <laughs> like hanging from the ceiling and i think it goes so well with like everything else in the room it helps us tie in more of that like boho you know free spirit <laughs> feel in here so um i just love how it looks it's cream and gold and once everything is like fluffed out the way i want for it to be fluffed out it'll look perfect what i plan to add in here is i want to add a nice rug in here and then to give you guys an idea of what I see happening on this side of um, my office space. So I have this little like stool bench thing that I want to keep in here. But the idea is that I want to get a cute like um, clothing rack to go in this corner. And that would be the area that I like pick out outfits. I put stuff together, play around with clothing and fashion. Like that's the fashion corner. <laughs> So that's what I plan to do over there. And then I want to add a nice like floor mirror on this side. I also found this um, print at, I believe it was Hobby Lobby. And I think it is so cute. It matches the theme and like the feel of this room perfectly. So I think I want to add this picture over here to go on this wall right here that's the wall that you first see whenever you walk into my office and i also excuse this clutter right here y'all this is just stuff that you know shouldn't be here but it is <laughs> but my idea is that i'll add that print like on this wall and then i'll also add a little itty bitty bench to go like right here on this um wall just to like add a little bit more seating room um a little cozy spot maybe add some like little pillows or like a little throw blanket on the bench just something cute and cozy something welcoming to come into my office and of course i need to add some sort of like office chair or you know decorative chair so i can actually sit here because what i have been doing is i've just been taking the chair from downstairs like in my downstairs kitchen table and bringing it upstairs whenever i want to sit here and that is getting tiring <laughs> so i need to find some sort of like office chair or like some just chair period to go right here so i can have a permanent seat and like not have to move stuff around any longer all right y'all so that's it for the office the last look next time you guys see it it will be hopefully complete so now we are in the final area of the home where i have some updates to share and it is like my favorite areas <laughs> of my house because we spend the most time down here it is the living room slash kitchen area i am still so in love and just so obsessed with like how things are coming together down here and just the updates that i've made in a short amount of time i feel like bringing this area together even more um so i'll go ahead and start with the kitchen area this area is practically the same for the most part not much has changed however i did finally 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 add some bar stools um i believe these two bar stools are from all modern i believe um and they're just simple black bar stools with like gold legs i love 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 how it looks in this space um 
Like once I added it, it felt complete. It just looks like it belongs there and for a while i was debating if i wanted to go black if i wanted to go black and gold if i wanted to go cream i even ordered some like lighter colored bar stools but i saw them and like it just did not fit it did not look right i needed something dark because like for the most part the kitchen is pretty bright so I was like, nope, the cream just is not flowing. Like it has to like, it has to balance. And so I went with these chairs and the minute that I put them there, I was like, yep, that's it. Like that was it. So I'll go ahead and do a close up of how they look. The top of the seat is like a faux leather material. And then of course you guys see the legs and yeah. I just ordered two of those bad boys and it works perfectly with my island and it just flows with everything else. I have a little touch of gold, you know, back there as well as on the hardware of my cabinet. So again, everything just kind of flows as it should. I love it. And then we come over here and I have also added a lamp as well as a throw basket and some throw blankets. Here is a better look at the actual lamp. I got this lamp from All Modern. I wanted something super sleek. Like this whole wall to me just feels very sleek, very modern, but still simple. And so I came across this um, lamp on All Modern and I just wanted to give it a try. I love the height of it. I wanted the height of the lamp to somewhat match the height of the plant because I didn't want for there to be too much of, you know, too much of a difference in height. So the height was practically perfect <laughs> with the plant. And yeah, it's a simple matte black lamp. I love like the curve because it adds a little bit of extra something different, you know? Um, so I love the curve. I love just like this part <laughs> of the lamp. It's just sleek, but it's still a little different and it makes this wall pop even more. And then of course you guys know how much I love, love, love baskets. I love throw blankets. I love to have options to choose from whenever I wanna get cozy. <laughs> so I needed a basket to hold all of my blankets and I came across this basket at Home Goods. Like the style of it is cute. It's a nice size. It's pretty big actually. So it's a nice size. It holds all of my blankets. I think I have like four or five in there and yeah, it's just, it's perfect. I love the look of it. I love the pattern. I love, of course, the texture. Just everything about it looks so good in this corner. So yeah, a simple update, some simple additions, but they definitely do change the look and feel of the space. And yeah, that wall is pretty much complete. And then finally over here. So this wall, you guys know, was like my problem child. I took forever to figure out what I wanted to go on this wall. And I finally found what I've been looking for. Like I finally figured it out. So first things first, I love this entry table. I got it from All Modern. It's like a really pretty like rustic brown slash gray top. Um, it just gives more of like a rustic kind of modern farmhouse feel, um, which I feel like I have hints of that throughout my house so it fits in perfectly. But then you have the gold legs, which of course keeps it much more modern and much more of like a feminine, you know, glam feel and look. So I love the balance there and the contrast there. And then I also found this round black mirror. It's more of like an industrial style mirror. It's, you know, of course it's round. It has like the black halo. And I think it makes this wall pop so well. It's not too big, it's not too small. It's like the perfect size in this space. So it doesn't feel overpowering because this wall also doesn't have like a ton going on. I didn't want for like any like area to be just like cluttered or, you know, 
too much going on <laughs> so um this i think looks perfect um i'm still adding decor to the table so i'm not done decorating the entry table i just got this up like two weeks ago so i'm still in the process of decorating the entryway table but what i do love is this lamp that i got from home goods just a couple of days ago the tag is still on it because i wanted to make sure i love it and i do um so yeah i just think it looks so 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 cute it's like soft it's just it's so pretty that is what we have going on so far you guys i love it i love it i love it i love it So that is it for home decor updates. Um, I, again, am just really loving my house. <laughs> and the more I decorate, the more I fall in love with it. We are making some progress. I am about to start adding my fall decor. So that will be, you know, put out <laughs> very, very, very soon. Of course, you guys will also see me do my fall decor. But I want to give you guys a separate update on the changes that have been made to my house before i start to jazz it up for fall um for the holidays so yeah i hope you guys enjoyed this home decor updates again don't forget to visit brooklyn for all of your bedding and towel needs they are offering a special discount to all of my viewers where you guys can get 20 dollars off any order over a hundred dollars so again all you have to do is click the link down below and use promo code alicia williams to get 20 dollars off any order over a hundred dollars i hope you guys enjoyed today's video if you guys did please go ahead and give this video a thumbs up and subscribe if you guys haven't already and as always i love y'all have a wonderful wonderful day and i will talk to y'all in the next video bye guys mm.